Right, today I'll be showing you how to fix the Nexus problem in Logic Pro. So you open up a project and then it crashes um, because of uh, Nexus. Um, oops, so I'm going to be showing you a quick example of that. I'm using Mountain Lion 10.8.5 and Logic Pro 9.1.8. So you load up the project, then it crashes like that, okay? And you can either the screen can flash as well, and then it'll do that. So what? How to fix it? You you need to go into your Macintosh HD. You can either do it like that or Command Shift and C. Then into Macintosh HD, uh, Library, um, Audio, Plugins, Components. And then you see the Nexus component here. I don't know why there's one in there. Yeah, I don't know what it's doing there. But um, yeah, and then you want to drag it out, put it on your desktop, and if it doesn't delete and it's still there, just click Command Backspace, put your password in, and get it deleted because it's just another copy. So minimize that. Go into the Logic Project you were using. And um, because Nexus isn't on here, it, it won't load it up and won't crash. And what you want to do, it's not available, so what you want to do is find the track with Nexus on. See, I'll have a, I've got two tracks on here, so what you want to do is just go to ESX24, just load it, that's it, like that and then on this one as well and then save it I do command and S, save it and quit it and then go back into um, components drag Nexus in, authenticate it and shut it down, then reopen New project and it should load. You will have to uh, open the same presets as well because it doesn't save your preset, unfortunately. So go back down here all instruments, reeffects, nexus. Just open both of them up. I'm not too fussed about the presets at the minute. Then Command S, save it, quit. And go back into it, and it should work. There we go. And two Nexus things. So, uh, if that helped, please like and subscribe. Thank you.